Hey y'all. Hey. We're on our way to pick up the big surprise. Yay. Yes, it's something we have to pick up. Yeah, we're in the van. Yeah, we're in the van. With a whole Which doesn't really pile narrow down. Children. And the van doesn't really narrow down the surprise because yeah. we bought all kinds of stuff in here. Yeah. Yeah, not, not your typical uh, van usage no, type thing. It's a but farm van. Yes. <laughs> It's so, the family farm van. It's definitely farm related. Oh yeah. So we're That's excited. Exciting. We're excited. I'm I'm, I'm, happy. I'm quite excited. Which I can't believe funny. I forgot in their last video what we were doing. <laughs> that, that was, was pretty just, funny. Yeah, it was pretty funny. So, but, uh, well, yeah. we're on and our way. It's about an hour drive to where we're going, right? Yeah, an okay. hour and five minutes to be exact. Okay. So, but we also, um, you talked to Gallagher today, and we're yep. going to be should be getting the rest of our Gallagher stuff soon. Yeah, Gallagher. There's been a lot of um, issues with inventory and shipment because of everything going on in the world. Uh, things have gotten delayed on ships out in the ocean and whatnot. It's just craziness. So we've been waiting on some stuff from them, and we're super excited that we're yes. getting some stuff that we can utilize and show you guys um, How something you might works. be interested in using. So anyway, everything we've gotten from them has been awesome. Yeah. So, Definitely. But we're excited. What we're going to pick up now is not Gallagher stuff. Doesn't have anything to do with that. No. <laughs> we might use Gallagher. Well, we will use Gallagher, though, with it. Yeah, for these. For this. For these, this. These, this, that. Items, things, whatever they are. <laughs> All right. Well, we're headed that way. All right. We have made it to our destination. We have. We haven't talked to anyone here yet. Right, we're turning around. We're going to get so back in over here. Straightened up here. So yeah. All right. We have arrived. We have arrived at our destination, and now we must go find someone. So we're here, <laughs> and this is Miss Red. Hello. So she has tons of cool animals, like lots. There's ducks. There's a baby goat, which we may or may not be here for. There's something buried in the grass right here in a hole that kind of startled me a second ago. Oh, a little quail. There's a quail down in the hole here. Look. She's been in the infirmary, so Aww. she's out and doing better now. Yep. Isn't that cool? Peachicks. There's pea chicks oh. over here. Like More chickens there. Tons of rabbits over there. Ducks over here behind Jack. And I have a feeling we're just getting started. Horses. Miniature horses. There's a whole bunch of quail. Priscilla. Priscilla. They're so cute. I know. <laughs> Can we take these home with us? Look at these mini donkeys. Oh my goodness, they're so cute. Hi. Hey there, dude. He is. Look at all the chickens. Is that a blue slate? With my blue slate and his Narragansett hens. Yeah. And then the white pair I, I just happened upon from a farmer. They are Holland Whites. Okay. And they are they were the very first turkeys with the pilgrims back in the day. Wow. They don't get cool. very big and they're very difficult to find. I just lucked out on a pair. Right. Um, and a hen. Wow. That's my loud mouth African geese over there. <laughs> what a cool that's, little pond. That's Henrietta. She's just kind of our mascot. She runs around laying eggs over there. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, All of them are so oh, friendly. Oh, micro like mini. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I like the micro mini. She yeah. was taken in the house between nursings as, an, as a baby. Wow. She's pet therapy. She goes in the back of the SUV That's and goes hilarious. visits handicapped kids. Aww. Wow. That's awesome. Oh, 
The duck and goose pond. I like that. I do too. That is cool. All right, so here's what we're here for. Hey. Charlotte. And her babies. The twins. <laughs> the twins. Look how cute. Hey, Charlotte. Hey. Hey. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Tirza. And Tirza is Petey's mama. There you are. What do you have, Hopi? What is it? A baby goat? Mm -hmm. Yep. She's gonna be shining. Alright. Oh, goodness. Oh, I know. Huh? I know. Josiah, do you have a friend? No. No? It looks like you do. Your hair do and her hair do kind of look alike. She'll stay with you all day if you do that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's cool. Okay. <laughs> uh, didn't, I didn't mean to pin you in there. That's all right. We'll take that off. Yeah. Charlotte. <laughs> Don't jump on the van. Yeah. Hold on. Right, we'll jump back Charlotte's out. ready. She's yeah. ready. Yeah. Yep, she wants Come in, on. doesn't she? Go on in. Oh, you're heavier, goat. <laughs> Good grief. <laughs> All right, we are almost home. Yep. And we have a bunch of kids and three extra kids, goat kind, and then two goats in the very back. Jacob is holding one little baby goat. So we have Charlotte and Tirza, who yep. are Nubian goats. This is the first freshening, first time they've kitted. Um, and Miss Red got them as babies and bred them and had them and now um, she has a lot going on at her as can farm see. as you can see and so it just um, she realized pretty quickly that it was just more than she was interested in doing right now having dairy animals yes so she contacted us and offered them to us and we were really excited she, <laughs> so, yeah, we couldn't believe it she's she was excited for them to go to people that she knew that she knew they would be well taken care of yeah. and that and it's a huge blessing to us because yeah. now the girls have their goat milk they've been wanting yay we're excited we're gonna do soap and i think it was some goat cheese and stuff like that so we're really yep. excited um so that's how that came about it's just one of those all of a sudden things happened i think two days ago we decided this and she contacted you two or three days ago and here yeah. we are going around we with them so um, well, one of them, Tirza, had one single buckling, and she's, um, and so he's being bottle fed, and so she has already been milked and does great, so we're going to milk her. And then Charlotte has twin bucklings, and we are going to be milking her too, but we are going to give her a few days probably before we start taking her babies yeah. away. Um, so we'll get her used to that, get the use of the new place and all of that, so we're just, get her settled yeah. in and used to us and everything. Yeah. So, uh, I feel like I was going to say something else and I can't remember what it was. Oh, anyway. <laughs> um, that happens to me a lot. It's mom brain. <laughs> uh, but we're excited. Oh, the three bucklings. So, we have three bucklings. Obviously, we don't need three bucklings. And we are going to be selling them, most likely all three of them. We do have the option we could keep one of them and then breed... Um, save them and breed Arwen, Florence, and whichever mom it doesn't belong it's not to. The mom. Yep. But then we still have the problem that we have one goat that can't be bred and keeping them separated and figuring out how we can breed her with another, you know. So we think we would be best to go ahead and sell the three bucklings. And that way, um, when it comes time to breed, we can just either get service, find somebody who will, you know, has a buck to service them, or depending on what we have set up what we have going on we right. can get a buy our own buck um so because at some point we we'll probably will keep a buck just because it'll be because we're going to be goat farmers <laughs> we are goat farmers we are goat farmers we, yeah extraordinaire goat farmers right i don't know about yeah. extraordinaire we're not okay. there yet <laughs> no we will be that's what's saying. yes we will yeah. be uh anyway so that's the plan and we are going to we stopped and got collars um i don't know where they went i don't know the girls have them 
they have them. So just a blue one and a green one. Um, they didn't have pink and purple, that's what I wanted, but <laughs> I had to sell for blue and green, but yeah. they're still green pretty is your colors. Color, though. Green is my color. Look at those green. eyes. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, so we did get them collars and we we're going to go home and put up some poultry netting. I don't know why we didn't think about that before we left. I have an idea too that I haven't ran by yet. Okay, well he has an idea and we got to build a milk stand. So we have a lot to do. Um, yeah, to get and it's only 4.40 4 40, in the so. evening. So, you know. Yeah, no, no. And we haven't eaten. I haven't eaten anything all day. That's not good. I no, I haven't. Breakfast I and lunch, skinned so. animals and yeah, you were like busy. our fur bearing animals that we trapped back in the fall and they've winter. been in my freezer they've been in the freezer and we needed freezer space so it was time to get them out they were in a freezer them. without other meat they were just no, in their own freezer <laughs> it was a freezer but dedicated to it's gonna trapped be animals but it's not gonna be anymore now yeah. we're gonna clean it really good and then it's gonna have food in it so <laughs> anyway all right well we will get home this keeps unfocusing okay crazy we will get home and get these goats out and see how they do Well, there they oh, are. They need a little bit more water in their pans. We'll top them off. Let's, here. let's go build them a shelter. All right. And, uh, so Derek's going to build them a shelter. That's what I had thought of. I hadn't told Jenna yet. <laughs> that's his idea. Yeah. So, yeah, it's a good idea. He's going to build a shelter, and they look happy. So. They do. All right. Well, that's our big surprise. Yeah. We got two goats of milk and their three bucklings. So, we went from a herd of five to a herd of ten. Like it's goat math. You goat always math, talk about that. Yeah, and speaking of goat math, I, I am collaborating with Sarah's Farmhouse now, and she sells really cute goat merchandise. It's like it says goat math, shirts, and cell phone covers and pillows, all kinds of cool stuff. So there's a link below that is to that shop in the description, and you can get 10% off with my coupon code. But if you're having goat math like me, you might want to get you some cute goat <laughs> merchandise. <laughs> I just forgot about that one to throw that in there. Yeah. But anyway, all right, well, we appreciate y'all. Oh, the brown goat ran into the fence. All right, they're learning electric. Yep. Oh, into her friend? She ran into her friend. Okay. Oh, she ran to her friend. Oh, okay. I get you. She did run to her friend. All right, we appreciate y'all. Thanks for coming along with us on our, our crazy adventures and our big surprises. Like lots more goats are doubling our herd and if you're not already subscribed please go ahead and subscribe to our channel and give us a thumbs up so youtube will know you're enjoying what you see if you hit the notification bell you'll be notified every time we upload a video please comment below let us know what you think what's going on in your world and we'll catch you next time see y'all later